While chasing down a part for our Achilles tank destroyer, I've just come across one of its most terrifying foes, the infamous Pac-40, the backbone of Germany's anti-tank force. Unleashed following the invasion of the Soviet Union, this was probably the most feared anti-tank gun of the war. And this might be the only working Pac-40 in the country. Show me how to shoot this thing. Pat, you want to show them the mechanism down there? Sure. So right here is the traverse. OK. Right here is the elevation. Yep. And then usually the sight guy usually sits there and adjusts the cannon to okay. sight it in. So I would use the sight. I would use my traverse. I would use my elevation. I would find my target. In this case, an unsuspecting barrel. Target is locked. And now what? We load it. OK. Oh, we're ready to shoot? Yes, sir, we are. All right, well, safety first. Eyes and ears. OK, eyes and ears. My armor. I'm going to armor up. 75-year-old piece of artillery. Three-foot homemade projectile. What could go wrong? OK. I have never experienced anything like that before in my life. It's like, um, it's like someone took a firecracker and directly inserted it into my sinus cavity. I sometimes <laughs> describe it as like a bitch smack from God. <laughs> There's one problem, though. Looks like we missed. To be forthright, I don't know what we hit, because the moment I hit, I hit the trigger, Everything went black and red. Like, everything went black and red. It exploded with enough force to hurl a three-foot shell down the barrel at almost 2,600 feet per second. Incredibly, experienced crews could get off more than 10 shots a minute. Let's shoot it again. Let's do it again. Let's, that's the great, greatest idea I've ever heard in my life. Three, two, one, fire in the hole! That barrel got off lucky. At this range, this monster could blast through half a foot of steel. It would have ripped through the inch and a half thick sides of our Achilles with ease. No wonder their crews were terrified of this weapon. I can taste what that sounded like. Some of the cannon guys have said it's like you're being reborn. You have that adrenaline rush, and it's like the whole world just opened up, and there you are. <laughs> this is truly a baptism by fire. I have been reborn. <laughs>